Uh, so we're going to talk a little bit about the data communication path that a mobile um, device, an end-to-end -end device, would take to get from the actual mobile to the host application servers on the other side. The device communicates with the radio access network, um, registers on the GSM and GPRS network, and then communicates to the network operators, GGSN, at which point um, a PDP context is established. At that point, an IP address would be assigned down to the device. The device then communicates over the radio access network through the network operator, and then from the network operator, either over a VPN or over the internet, down to the host application servers. Um, questions are often asked about why would a device utilize a VPN or an internet connection specifically? Why one over the other? Um, an internet connection would generally take a private uh, IP address and at the firewall of the operator, um, NAT that, and then communication would be over that data connection down to the host application servers. This works fine for devices that are typically where most of the data is going to be mobile originated, where the mobile is going to reach out to the host application server and pull data off of it. It doesn't work quite as well if the host application server needs to initiate um, data transfer down to the device or do what we call mobile terminated data. The problem with um, doing mobile terminated data over an internet um, connected session is that the IP address often changes and the carrier oftentimes will not allow the um, traffic to flow back through their network down to the device. For those types of applications, we generally recommend that you utilize a VPN. Um, a VPN will allow the device to communicate over a private IP address through the operator's network over the VPN tunnel down to the host application server and allow the host application server to utilize that same private IP address to communicate back through the network down to the device. So generally speaking, a VPN is going to be preferable if we're doing um, mobile terminated applications that are going to require mobile terminated data. Also, the VPN um, encrypts traffic between the network operator and the host application server, which adds another layer of uh, security.